The first thing we need to do is to open the App Store. Once you're inside the App Store, you want to click the search icon in the bottom right hand corner. And then you want to tap the search bar at the top, or you want to type Google Gemini. Once you've searched Google Gemini, it should be the top result, and it should look like this. Now to download the app, you want to click on the Get button. And then you'll be prompted to Confirm, so we're going to double click the Side button. Once we've done this, after a few seconds, the app will begin to download to your iPhone. Once the application has been downloaded, we can exit out of the App Store. And now we can go ahead and open the Google Gemini app, just as we normally would. When you open the app for the first time, you're prompted to log into your Google account. So you want to go ahead and do that. When you log into your account, you see this welcome screen. So you want to read through this information here. And once you're ready, you want to click on Use Gemini. And once you're ready, you can go ahead and start using Google Gemini, just as you normally would. If you want to access your chat history, you want to click on the speech bubble icon in the top left hand corner. And then you'll be able to access your chat history from here. However, I don't have any chat history as of recording this video. If you want to change which Gemini model you're using, you want to click on the model number at the top of the screen. And then you can select it from here.